What up, what up? Hey, y'all, I want to talk about Atlanta Falcons wide receiver Kevin Ridley. Now, y'all know Kevin Ridley is a former Alabama standout. His best season with the Atlanta Falcons was 2020. He had over 1,000 yards receiving. Now, this past season, Atlanta Falcons made Kevin Ridley their number one, but things didn't go as planned. Kevin Ridley ended up taking some time off because of mental health issues. Now, they say while he was out for mental health issues, he was betting on football games. He even betted on the Atlanta Falcons. Now, the NFL, they got a firm that checks and see that players are betting on games. They paying $100 million to this firm to verify stuff like this, man. Now, Kevin really has tweeted that he only bet $1,500 and that he don't have a gambling problem. Brother, you made a mistake, man. It best not to tweet nothing. I wish you wouldn't have did this, but it is what it is. Now, the last person that got suspended from the NFL by betting on football games, he's still looking to try to get a job in the NFL. He's still a free agent. Now, Kevin really, he probably going to appeal this suspension, but I doubt if he get it reduced, man. Roger Goodell wrote him a long letter, man, saying you put the integrity and the reputation of the game on line, man. Like I said, this is a bad look for Kevin Ridley. Atlanta Falcons are prepared to move on without it, man. They probably going to cut him after this suspension is up or either they're going to try to trade him. But like I said, it's probably going to be hard for Kevin Ridley to get a job back in the league, man. Once you make a move like this, ain't nobody really going to want to trust you. They don't know where you're coming from. Are you going to be betting on our games or what? You know, like I said, this is a bad look. But I want to hear what you guys think about this. Also, hit the like button and hit the subscribe button. Thank you.